Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to hopefully resolve the Windows 10 or Windows 11 error message that reads that we can't find your camera. Check to be sure it's connected and installed properly, that it isn't being blocked by antivirus software, and that your camera drivers are up to date. If you need it, here's the error code. Again, 0XA00F244. No cameras are attached. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process, guys, on how to resolve it. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu, search for device manager. Best result should come back with device manager. Go ahead and open that up. You want to expand the camera section in here. So assuming you have a camera hooked up to your computer, there should be a driver in there. Pretty straightforward process on that again. So locate cameras. Double click on it, there should be a camera listed under here and you would right click on it and select update driver. Again, I'm just selecting batteries. I don't actually have a camera connected to my computer, but you would do this for cameras. So once you're in the, how do you want to search the driver field, go ahead and search browse my computer for drivers and then select, let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. And then you would select next again, close out of here. And then hopefully that would be able to resolve the problem. Something else you may want to try here as well, going on to the manufacturer's website. So if you're using an external camera, you might want to go on to Google, search up that make and model of camera and see if there are any software packages available from the manufacturer, like Logitech, for example. Just Google the webcam make model and then just type in a software update. And then just make sure you're going on to the manufacturer's website. And then they usually have packages you can just download and install very easily onto your computer, just like any normal program, just with download and install it. So again, that'd be something else I'd recommend taking a look into. One other thing we can look at as well would be to open up the search menu. Type in settings, best match, should come back with settings. Go ahead and open that up. On the left side, select apps. And then on the right side, underneath apps, select installed apps. In search apps field, you can either search for camera or you can just scroll down the list here. It should be pretty close to the top, assuming you don't have too many programs installed. And you want to select the three-dotted icon next to it and select where it says advanced options. Scroll down underneath reset. If the app isn't working right, we can try to repair it. The app's data won't be affected. Select repair. And then once that's done, you can see if the issue's been resolved. If not, you can try the second option here. Where if the app still isn't working right, reset it. The app's data will be deleted. So if you click on the reset button, it will say that this will permanently delete the app's data on this device, including your preferences and sign-in details. Select reset. And then once that's done, close out of here. And I would suggest restarting your computer. And there you go, guys. Hopefully this point or issue has been resolved. And as always, thank you for watching. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.